Hello, I'm Amber Tallarico and I'm gonna explain the makeup that I did on this beautiful corpse <laughs> bride. <laughs> so uh, the first thing that I did was I always prep the face um, with a skin saver uh, moisturizer to make sure that when she takes off the makeup it's gonna be easy to take off. Then the second thing is I took uh, an Elmer's glue and basically glued down her eyebrows because uh, we went obviously bigger with the eyes so the eyebrows have to be laying a certain way so that when makeup goes over it, it kind of disappears um, so I did that I did a few layers of that several layers to make sure that all of the hairs are laying in the same direction um, after that I kind of counteracted the color with an orange so went in with that after that I powdered between pretty much every uh, every layer once that was done, I started doing the, the blue color, so I took an airbrush color, um, mixed a white and a blue to make this kind of like uh, very light blue, and then I sprayed the rest of or her entire face down to her neck, um, powdered, and then did a second layer just to make sure that everything was smooth. After that, I powdered it again, and um, then I went in with some uh, water-based uh, face paint and basically took the white, created the eyes, um, and then sometimes water-based paint can get a little streaky, so after that I went over with a white um, airbrush color just to smooth everything out. Then after that, I used a, uh, the face paint, the black face paint to do the uh, around the eyes and then to create the eyebrows, the eyelashes, and then the actual uh, pupils. Um, then I started kind of adding some contouring color, so I took just a, um, a shadow, a blue shadow, did the eyeshadow, kind of contoured her cheeks a little bit underneath her chin, down the nose, and I actually created a little bit of a pointier nostril because hers is very, very pointy. It's almost skeleton-like, so um, did that, and then at the very end, I did the lips and I combined two colors. One was kind of a deeper fuchsia and then the top one is kind of a pink so I kind of got a nice uh, mix between the pinks to create that very pink lip color that she has. Then we put a wig on and then we put the headband on and the rest is wardrobe and then <laughs> what her wardrobe is. <laughs> so yeah that's it. 